Just got back from my morning run and Ken has told me that um, I need to sweat to lose weight. So I wore a waterproof on top of my windproof jacket and I almost died as I didn't drink enough water last night or I didn't take any sugary tea this morning before my run. So we stopped off at Ken and Helen's place for water and tea, three cups, um, where I also weighed myself and now I weigh 59.2 kgs, which is two and a half kilos I've lost in two weeks. So I'm pretty chuffed. Anyway, today I'm gonna show you just what champion Kenyan athletes eat throughout the day. So we're off for breakfast. Here are all the boys huddled around the kitchen waiting for their breakfast. So here is Oliver making tea. So how do you make the tea, Oliver? You first boil the water. You have, after uh, boiling, you have, to, uh, you have milk and then tea leaves. Tea leaves? And, and these are just, the tea leaves just here? Yes, this is tea leaves. Ah. And then after that, you finish with the sugar. And this is what all athletes drink? Yes. All Kenyans drink? All Kenyans. Yeah. yeah. This is their breakfast. The breakfast? Yes. You have it with bread? Yeah, with bread. And sometimes with bananas. <laughs> So breakfast consists generally of tea, how we just saw it being made, and, and bread. That's what these guys eat, and uh, still pretty speedy. I go for a run with no breakfast, come back and have this. These guys, Nicholas, how is your breakfast? <laughs> he has three pieces in one go, every day. It's good? Two, three, four, and take like this. <laughs> and that's how Jeffrey eats his. <laughs> and today we're lucky we get bananas too. Yes. Just on my way back to go for lunch, but I've got to show you these guys because every day I pass them and every day they shout Mazungu, Mazungu and they start showing off their skills, okay? Ready? <laughs> so, sometimes you get shy kids in Kenya. These ones are definitely not shy. <laughs> shy. So Oliver, what is for lunch today? Lunch for the day is rice and potatoes. Rice and potatoes. Yeah. So yesterday was beans, no today beans is today. potatoes. Yes. Ah, yummy. Thank you, Asante. Kongoi missing. Karibu. <laughs> so Ben, is this a good lunch? Yeah, it's good. Good for carbohydrates? Carbohydrates for the day. Is that after a long run? After. Normally, I'd never eat potatoes and rice in one meal but I'm knackered from running every day twice a day here so it's actually mm, really good finished surprisingly really nice hey okay. Ben finishes a while ago yeah. didn't he yeah. so it's dinner time today Nicholas is dishing up I'll just show you what is for dinner yeah, meat and skooma Meat and skooma. Ah, and what is the meat? Uh, what? For cow. Cow. <laughs> wow. <laughs> it looks delicious. Yes. Ah, so this is for protein. Yeah. And what is skooma? Um, uh, leaves. Leaves, yeah. Uh, okay. And, and spinach. Spinach. Ah, I Noodle. will like. Asante. <laughs> <laughs> Kongoi. Ah, Kongoi missing. <laughs> and we also get Ugali. <laughs> which is he? Which is a staple Kenyan diet, isn't it? Yeah, yeah. It's made of maize? Maize and when you, you want to cook Ugali, you put water in the, fire, in the fire. And then when it's boiled, it's hot, you start cook. So Ugali is what all athletes eat the yeah, night before? Yeah, yeah. You have to eat ugali at the night and then when you wake up morning, you have the strength or your stomach is full. So full. you will not get hungry yeah. when you are training. You wouldn't eat rice at night time. Ugali is the best source yeah, of carbohydrates. When, when you eat rice tomorrow, you will feel hungry. So no energy to cook to, uh, to go for training. So if I eat ugali, I eat like a champion. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. 
because so many champions it will gal yeah even david rudisha take a gal so there you go and yigali mm. tastes a little bit like mashed potato mm, without the butter <laughs> so i just say eskuma beef spinach and yugali and today i've eaten exactly what kenyans eat i even had coffee just after lunch which came with cake and i did not have it i gave it away so i am eating exactly like a kenyan for the next two weeks to lose the kilos and eat like a champion yeah yeah, yeah. <laughs>